So Andrew just showed us how simple this whole process is. Let's go see it actually in action. Hey Dave. Hi. What are you doing in here? Oh, just checking on my cultures. Oh, well, it looks like you're swirling something up to eat. Is this something worthwhile? To eat? Yeah. Mm, it would be harmless. Yeah? Yeah, there'd be some nutritional value there. So what's going on here? Well, we're um, just getting some cultures ready for experiments. Do you ever get hypnotized just staring at this? Yes. I time. think you are yeah. hypnotized. Yeah. You are. You got this stuff just locked down. So it. this just swirls like this, so yep. it won't settle down, so right. that it will do what faster? It keeps the cells from settling into a film, uh -huh. uh, and if they settle into a film, uh, their metabolic state changes, they don't uh -huh. grow as well. So now if you took this prototype concept and expanded it, how big would that tank be? Um, this swirling approach works okay, for, works great for these small flasks, these small volumes. Um, if the volume gets too much bigger, um, swirling doesn't work so well. Uh, you start having gas exchange issues. Uh, so if you get really big, the format needs to change. Okay, so this is, this is like all part of the testing, extremely important. We gotta know what happens here first before you go to a larger scale. Yeah. Bottom line. Yep, yeah. exactly.